Well, an important safety message from a Clearfield family tonight after a devastating accident. A husband and father facing a long road to recovery. And as new specialist Alex Cabrero shows us, it could have been a lot worse. Alex? This is one of the moments Carly Seymour knew her husband just might be okay. It was scary the first couple of days. He didn't remember who I was. And I would say, hey, who am I? And do you know who I am? And he just... Mm -mm. Now, Taylor Seymour knows who she is, as well as their two children. Slowly every day, we've made a little bit more progress. That progress now includes walking. But watching Seymour doing it, you would never know he suffered a traumatic brain injury from a longboarding crash just two weeks ago. A multiple skull fractures on his temporal bones here and here, and then um, on his uh, sinus all the way up to his ear here and then he just had like multiple brain bleeds. Seymour was with his friends longboarding on a trail in Provo Canyon when something went wrong causing him to lose his balance and hit his head hard on the ground. He wasn't wearing a helmet something he and his wife had talked about before and something they're now asking everyone who does these types of activities to do. It just takes one slip one fall one something and it can it could have ended up a lot worse. Like I could be sitting here without a husband. Carly also says she has received countless calls offering help, meals, whatever. And when two of his friends set up a GoFundMe account, she never thought people would donate. Couple days, I didn't look at it. And then I looked at it and I was like, oh, my jaw just hit the floor. More than $30,000 showing not only is Taylor loved, but a lot of people are hoping he gets better soon. I can't say thank you enough to everybody that's helped. Carly says they could be here for another two weeks to go through the rehab process, but again, doctors are telling her that her husband is expected to make a full recovery. She also says she knows at some point her husband will want to go longboarding again, to which she had one word to say, helmet. In Murray, Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News.